So this morning is a holiday in Canada. And so I wanted to sleep in because I never get to sleep in. And Dean also wanted to sleep in because he had a long Sunday yesterday. So of course we weren't like sleeping knocked out, but we were just resting in the bed. So Dean woke up, gave the girls breakfast, um, took care of them, um, making sure that the snacks and everything were accessible. So I was downstairs. Um, what did you say? You're going to grandma's house to play? Yeah. That's so exciting. Who do you want to see? Oh wow. Yeah, it's gonna be a good time. Uncle Kevin won't tickle me. Uncle Kevin won't tickle you? Uncle Kevin won't tickle me. Yeah, he's gonna tickle you because it's fun, right? Yeah, but it's funny. It's funny, yeah. Yeah. So just getting up to the main level now and the place is a mess. Mommy, the kids help themselves to cereal. I came up I came down and look what I'm seeing. A Lucky Charms box it, randomly in the hallway, okay? They don't like the cereal in this box. They only eat the charms, but we of course don't allow that. So we come upstairs. So we get into the kitchen and they got their way with the cereal. Somebody was doing nail polish. Nail polish even on her forehead. Cereal ate out all of the charms. Papers on the floor everywhere. We got ripped up stickers. And this big girl even made a FaceTime call to her auntie. Like, who even are these kids? I mean, Oh my goodness. Y'all, it's a mess up here. It's gonna take all day to clean. Auntie, why you let this happen? <laughs> Not my sister on FaceTime asking why we left her to babysit. That's perfect. That's why you gotta have a number of sisters and, and brothers, right? Why are you crying? So Auntie Michelle has been babysitting the girl, so she's about to give me the tea on what really happened upstairs. So right now the girls are on lunch break. So what are you having for lunch today? Today I got chicken, orange, ketchup, cucumbers, and cookies. Oh yeah. And dino, dino nuggets. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we eating good today. Of course, you're eating the cookie first. Today I'm not going from today. Yeah, today's a holiday. Yeah, well today um, well today I just needed something to drink. So could you give me something to drink? <laughs> Sure. All right, what's going on guys? So the time is currently 11.40 p.m. And we are about to juice for the first time. So as you guys can see, I got the Breville juicer machine or my jiggy, my thingy, my diggy, whatever. And yeah, it's going to be my first time using it. I'm excited to go on this journey because first of all, I've been experiencing chest pains and stomach pains for the last maybe four or five months, maybe a little bit longer than that, actually dating back to last year. Right, so I was diagnosed with this thing called H. pylori, which is like stomach bacteria, and then that led to one thing, which led to another thing, and now, after 50 things, we are where we are right now, which is right here, <laughs> right? And um, I'm still currently battling with a lot of stomach problems, so I took it upon myself just to see what I could do at home, if they'll help anything, because the doctors don't know what's going on, they say everything is good, but I don't feel like everything is good, so I was like, you know what, let's get a juicer. So I got the juicer, got Nikki over here, doing up the beets and all that good stuff is what we got going right now we got celery we got apple i don't know what this is i can't remember what this is but we got it from our cousin shelly it's either kale it's not kale or or what could it be i don't remember what she said it was but it's something from her garden she grew it and she said that it's amazing so we're gonna use it That's it. 
something from her garden. I, I literally can't remember which green it is, but it's something that's green and salad-y, right? But it ain't salad, it's something else. But yeah, so what I'm gonna be putting in it is that green thingy, whatever that is. We got celery, we got um, ginger, we got turmeric, we got apples, and we got beets. So, ooh, your boy is about to be on his healthy tip. You feel me? Uh, yeah, I'm excited. This thing apparently is a good one, so you better not let me down. All right, so we are about to get it done. Let's go. So, I don't okay. even know what you do. Nikki got this. I don't got this. It's your machine. It's your journey. Let me see you do it. Okay, I've so prepared all the veggies well, then, for you. Gonna, you're going to hold this? I got I got All you have to do is going to be so loud for them. But all you got to do is put the stuff in and watch it go down and make a mess. Smoosh it down. If it needs to be. All right, here goes nothing. Turn this bad boy. I didn't want it to, it was, I don't know if it would splash off. Did you get it stuck? Okay. Okay, so first time's a charm. Wasn't that much of a charm. I gotta figure this thing out. Right? It has grooves that you have to put inside the grooves. So you just pushed it in. There's grooves how it works. Also like this? Yep. And that's how you push it down. But from one beat, I mean, it's nothing at all, but <laughs> it'll soon come together. Well, let's just... No, you don't need to put multiple at a time. It's one at a time. So this is what we're going to do. We're it's gonna... just a one at a time thing. You don't have to do one at a time. I think there we have it like um it was just enough as you can see this jug is just about full hopefully it turned out right like hopefully it tastes good but yeah that was pretty dope i didn't know what the hell i was doing i'm not even gonna hold you like i'm like bro but i think it kind of worked out a little bit you want to put a lime a lemon a lemon taste Lime's it here. first hmm? Taste it and see if you like it, and then you could just squeeze a little in if you need it. Like you it. put a whole lemon, that's gonna no, make it so sour. No, I was gonna say, cut it in half. And then squeeze a little cut it in bit. Half and then just put it in there. Or cut a little piece and then just put it in there. Okay, it's your drink, whatever you want. Yeah, you know, I mean, I, hey man, we just experimenting, bro. Like, what the heck? Like, give a little, try a little, be a little, do a little. I ain't gonna hold you. It's gonna man. be so sour. You think so? uh, does this in that? Do your thing. Smells delicious. <laughs> Let's go. I gotta mix it up a little bit. All right, so I'm just taking off the little froth and all that stuff, guys. I don't want this thick texture. Then we gonna mix it up. Looks rich, those beets. Mix it up and then I'ma have me a glass and let's let's see how this thing goes. <laughs> like I gotta figure out how often I'm supposed to do this. I know people that drink celery juice like every morning. I know people that do it two, three times a month. I don't know. If you guys know, let me know in the comment section. Like legit, I'm just experimenting folks. It is what it is. 
but I think I'm gonna have my first glass. Shall we? <laughs> bon appetit. <laughs> I'm on Jill. Let's see how this is. Tastes like a like a drink. <laughs> <laughs> it's giving garden vibes, right? Garden salad. There you go. Yeah, I feel like there were better recipes we could have put together. No, but I, I, I like it. I, just, I think it, it just needs more. It needs more. Like if it had more ginger, it would be perfect. So blend some ginger and put it in it. Yeah, that's all. It, that's all this needs. Just more ginger. We got a plenty more ginger. It's funny that there's two of us that were on the project, but only one cup was served, right? No, that's it. You want no, to taste cause some? Yeah, taste some. No, cuz. Maybe taste it. Oh, suddenly. Taste it. <laughs> I <laughs> don't even want it. <laughs> you don't like it. You don't like it. <laughs> I know she hates it. <laughs> no, you don't like it, huh? It's not terrible. I see what you mean. It needs to be more chilled. Definitely colder. Yeah. But it's the ginger. Yeah. It needs it. It needs it. Oh, baby, that's what we didn't put. Turmeric. I don't think it would have made much of a difference yeah, man. in terms Tumeric. of flavor. Yeah, man. Turmeric, I'm telling you. What does turmeric taste like? I know from whatever that thing was that Kim made me that time, it tastes good. Like It adds like a tang. Like a tang. Like a tang. Like a tang. <laughs> <laughs> It does, I'm telling you. Well, finish this and then make yourself a new batch tomorrow. Or not tomorrow, whenever this is finished. Oh, okay. let's, let's do a little ginger in here right now. And, and you can do anything you want to. That's the beauty of this whole thing. So it's all it? just a mashup. In other news, um, I am doing so many things right now. And I have work tomorrow. Yeah, that's the ginger. Just wash it, some of it. You don't need that whole thing, oh. though. Um, yeah, in addition to that, I have ugh, losing my train of thought. It is so late. And I'm also working on other things. Like, I just started laundry because obviously you don't do laundry during the day, and we weren't home in the evening. So, I'm doing that tonight. And I just finished packing Mello's healthy, healthy lunch. One day I'm going to show you guys how we pack her lunch and what sorts of things we include in it, um, given that her diet is so strict and so healthy and so lovely. There go that machine. Also, in a previous vlog, I went shopping and got Mello some new indoor shoes. And I said that I was gonna show you guys, but I didn't actually end up showing you guys because obviously we forgot. So I ended up finding these cute little sneakers um, for her and she really likes them. They're a little bit big, but it should last her into next year and that's what we want. Um, and they have the Velcro and the no tie shoelaces. So they're perfect. So I've said so a million times, that's all. Also her backpack broke. I guess on the school bus or at lunch or something. So ended up getting her a new school bag as well. So this one's super cute. Um, it's got the pockets on the front and this one actually has a water bottle pocket on the side. And then of course, every little girl needs her little lip gloss and, and chapstick. So she has her little unicorn one here. And then her library books tomorrow because they got library day. So she should be getting another new library book. But I was so excited because she brought home an Arthur book. Arthur's like one of the best cartoons ever, 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 ever. So I was really excited for her to bring that home. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and see if Dean likes his new drink with the added ginger. How are you feeling about it? I think it's gotta be colder. It's okay. a little bit warm, so it's not it's not hitting like I was supposed to hit. But I'm also gonna ask Nikki's mom the exact proportion she used for this mix or whatever because yeah that was perfect like it had like a little sting to it that i want so yeah i mean either or i'll drink it because i like it regardless i just want it to be very enjoyable right now it's just like i'm drinking this because it's healthy so mm -hmm. yeah but we gonna get there man it's day one First but it time. looks nice rich and healthy mm -hmm. and of course when you start mixing different things it'll be better too yeah so Day one, I think it's a success because, hey, shoot, we a little bit healthier inside of me now. So, hey, 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 <laughs> here hey, I hey. come. 
Well, look how messy it is. Yep. Right. Dean's got a big job of cleaning this. There's all the trash in the pulp. Oh, well, let's see. It looks like. Well, that's a lot so of that's trash. what my brother was saying like if you use the cold press it literally like squeezes out everything mm -hmm. out of this because this right now is still moist yeah and it still has stuff in it but there's still great nutrients in that right. can't nobody afford that right now so mm -hmm. that's gonna have to wait <laughs> um yeah well happy washing babe i'm gonna go finish laundry and get ready for work tomorrow it is what it is i'm gonna do it, it tomorrow when it's cold and i'm gonna let you guys know how it tastes then until next time, you okay on me? Good morning, we're going to daycare to school. We're going to daycare to school and play. Yeah, I like yeah. your outfits. Mella, let's see your shirt. What is all that itching on your tummy? You feeling itchy? Yeah, just a little sick. Yeah, that's why you got some reactant. You should be fine now. And you? You feeling I'm good? Sick. Yeah. Alrighty, you guys have fun today. I'm late for work, so I gotta go. Peace. What's good guys? So we got a package, we got a package, we got a package from Fashion Nova. Let's see what's in this package, man. So I ordered a whole bunch of stuff. Nikki ordered some stuff on Fashion Nova and it's supposed to be Liddy. Like this is my first time ordering from Fashion Nova. I never ever ordered anything on here. So I don't know if the sizes are gonna be right or any of that good stuff, but we gonna find out today. So let's see how this goes. All right, let's open it up. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. Oh wow! What do we got here? Woo! Woo! Let's open up these bags and see what we got or whatever. So first thing first, this little jackety thingy, my jiggy, my thingy, my riggy. I got a large. I don't know if that's what I should have got. If I should have got something a little bit smaller, because you know your boy done lost a lot of weight. <laughs> Why is Nikki laughing? <laughs> but we gonna try it. We gonna. Whoa, it's big. Yeah, everything is big. That's yeah, a little bit too big. Large is big. Look at this, guys. Whoa. That means Loki, I'm probably gonna have to return everything. Wow. That is insane. Yikes! That's what happens when you lose weight. Like nothing is gonna fit. Unbelievable. But you know what? It is what it is. I actually got everything large too, man. Oh my god. <laughs> this is not the way I wanted it to start out. Definitely not the way I wanted it to start out. Alright, let's try this. This is not bad. This is I like the oversized vibe of this. Tell me what you guys think. Like, this ain't bad at all. Like, still a little big, but I think I might want to go a little bit big for this one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How you feel? How you feel? 25 sitting on 25 mil. Huh? So, guys, I forgot to film, but like, everything has been like a giant fail so far. So, Every single shirt that I got was too big. But everything looks good. So like yeah. the pieces are fire. Like I don't even want to come out here and show you guys how bad it is. <laughs> like I did, it's pretty bad. Like, so you know what? I'll probably show you guys one more outfit because there's one more outfit I got to try on. And I know for sure it's big. But I'm going to just do it for the hell of doing it. But yeah, it, 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 it didn't turn out how your boy thought it would turn out. I got so excited and yeah, buddy. I mean, I, it ain't it. But... Like I said, I'm gonna try on this one more, this one outfit, and uh, yeah, you guys can have fun laughing at me, I guess. All right, guys, so this is what we looking like. The shirt, like I told you, is big. The pants are actually huge. Look at these. But I'm not mad about it because I got short legs, right? <laughs> so these are the pants. If you can see, 
Let me go up here. These are the pants. This is the shirt. And yeah, it's hella big, but it is what it is. We don't know if they got a return policy or exchange policy or whatever, so we're about to find all of that out. And then, if they do, I'm getting it shipped back out. I'm gonna order the smaller sizes. And if they don't, then I think we stuck. I don't know. We gotta figure it out though. Nikki got some stuff, she loved it. And yeah, there's one outfit that she got that she's not really rocking with, so she's gonna bring that back as well. But yeah, house is a mess after trying all this stuff on. All these stuff are being returned, including the shirt I have on right now. The pants I'm not mad about because I can always take it in. I could customize it, do what I want to do with it, and all that good stuff. So I'm okay if it's long because it means I could do some work with it. But yeah, it is what it is. That's our fashion overhaul, I guess. Shoot. So what's up, guys? We just picked up Harmony from daycare. How you doing, baby? Yeah. Did you have so much fun at daycare today? Yeah. Yeah, was it a good day? Yeah. Did you get into a little accident at daycare? Uh -huh. Did you hurt your leg a little bit? Yeah. But you feel much better? Uh-huh. What did you get for your treat in the car? Chips. Chips? Yeah. You got to eat some chips, girl? Uh -huh. Do you like it? Uh-huh. Yeah, and what's in your bottle? Water. Waters, you got chips and water. Chips and water. Yay. Chips and water. Yeah, chips and water. Now we're gonna go to the store. So guys, um I'm currently at my dry cleaners because yeah, it was last sale or or like what do you call it? Final sale for the merchandise that I got. And um they actually didn't even have my size. They didn't have any mediums left. So what I'm about to do is go to my seamstress or whatever and see if she could alternate these larges and turn them into mediums man so that's where we're at right now so hopefully it goes well because man the pieces i got are too fire for me not to be able to wear them so it is what it is pray this goes well for your boy so what's good guys i just got a cut your boy is looking fly me and nikki got a wedding to go to tomorrow so you know i had to get my hair done all that stuff nikki's at the house doing her hair and yeah man we celebrate in love tomorrow it's gonna be the first time we got dressed up in a long time so we know we had to show up and show out what you guys think about the cut you guys think the cut look good do you think it look good do you think it look good like yeah uh, your boy fresh and your boy fly yes sir but yeah i know nikki's do her thing she's beautiful whether she got her hair done or not but man we're about to be liddy like I'm so happy. We get to celebrate love, get all dolled up with my queen, all that good stuff. So yeah, man, let's get it. Boy, golly. All right, guys, so we're at the wedding. This is what we're looking like right now. You can't see Nikki's dress because she's wearing her coat. But this is what your boy look like. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And yeah, man, celebrating love. We were actually late. We didn't get to see the ceremony, but we're in time for the reception. So we're about to get it on and popping and have a good time. So let's get it. Let's go. So we're inside. This is the vibe. This is what the vibe is looking like. And this is the queen, Nikki. She's out here doing the most with her dress, but look at her. Ain't she fire? My button fell off, so I'm sewing. Ain't she fire? This girl is Miss Do It All. Like, it don't matter. She's gonna get the job done. And she did. She looks so beautiful. Look at her hair. Look at her. Like, oh, gee, gee. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the shoulder bling. Look at the shoulder bling, bro. <laughs> But yeah, so we're just gonna try to get some quick photos in because I know by the time we get upstairs, start the reception, all that stuff, it's gonna be nighttime and we we'll probably won't be able to get photos. So let's get it done, show you guys how these photos turn out. Let's get it, let's go! Elevator vibes is going to the wedding. Y'all don't look so fly with that hat. Let me see, let me see. When's the last time you wore that hat? Dog, years. <laughs> 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 like five, six years. That's crazy. You know what? I can low key rock that with this. So, brought it oh, back. Oh, hey, I can do a photo like this here. So today is a special day because I am taking the girls out on a girls day with our friends and their children. So it's about to be a whole play date. Melody and Harmony have no idea where they are. Come down a little bit. It's too dark. Boom. They have no idea where they are, but they're about to have some fun. Look at one of Melody's cousins. She's so amped. Oh my gosh, it's about to be such a fun day. I've never been here before. My sister has. Um, so she really knows what it's about. And she said it was a good time. So I think the kids are going to have a really, really great time. 
So stay tuned for the trip, y'all. Time to wake up Harmony, actually. Excuse me, my cousin wants to come in here. Come. Say what up to the vlog. Hi, Kenny Benny. Hi, Anthony. Oh, Hi, yeah. I'm going to come and tell my sister to take off her seatbelt. Are you ready to have a good day? Yeah, we're gonna have some fun. So we're gonna get Harmony out the car, we're gonna get Coco out the car, and then we're gonna go meet the other friends. So we have made it to the play place. Um, this place is insane. I would show you guys around, but there's so many people and so many children, so I don't wanna get anybody's children on camera. But they've met up with their new friend, Mackenzie, and we're just waiting on two uh, more kitties to join us, our other friend, Christine. Um, and when I get a chance, I'll show them to you guys, and we'll get things going. But say hi to my sister, y'all. They're my twin. There go my twin. Melody, come down the right way. Woo! Good job. Harmony, are you having fun? Sure. One, two, three. You guys come. One, two, three. Woo! Two, three. Go! Woo! We got the girls climbing up this step thing oh yeah the two big girls are here where's Melody oh there she is where's Kenny there you are I'm gonna get them coming down the slide ready go harmonies first Woo! Put your feet down so your socks don't stop you. Woo! Woo! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Chris has entered the party! And Tanisha, y'all say what up to the vlog! And here comes Kim! Let's go! <laughs> what are you guys doing? Oh my gosh, are you guys swimming in the bubble? What's your favorite part about this place? I love it because I, I love going here. Why? What do you love about it? Because everybody here and I know that it's the best thing. Yeah. Chloe, are you having fun? Yay! Yes! Harmony, are you having fun? Yeah! Awesome! Let's throw some balls up in the air and throw them like we just don't care. Woo! Oh yeah, it's like a swimming bubble pool. Whoa. Whoa. Melody, let me bury you. Go down. Let's hide her, let's hide Melody. Let's hide her, let's hide her. Woo, let's hide her, we can't find her. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Where did Melody go? Melody, jump up, jump up. Melody, jump up. Ooh. Your turn, let's hide Kennedy. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, where did Kennedy go? Jump up, oh yeah. Okay, let's hide Chloe. Everybody, cover Chloe, cover Chloe. Jump up, Chloe. There you are. Harmony, let's hide Harmony. Everybody hide Harmony. Okay, Harmony, come up. Jump up, jump up. Everybody, let's hide Mac. Let's hide Mackenzie. Woo! Hide her. Okay, Mackenzie, come up. Oh yeah. Okay, Melody's about to go on this big slide. Are you gonna do it? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Y'all, they just went down that huge slide. It is not for me. I do not do tunnel slides at all. This place is so fun. It's just so busy, obviously, because it's the weekend. But this place is great, and I do recommend coming back on like a weekday where it's not so busy. So right now, I'm upstairs by myself. I don't know where my children are. Oh, there's one. Hi, Mama. Yeah, you want to see over here? Come. Look, where are we? Watermelon and over. Whoa, <laughs> it's okay. Mommy's gonna fall too. Whoa, 
Whoa. Huh? Go. You're not gonna fall. It's a glass. Harmony's afraid to cross it because it looks like she's gonna fall in the hole. It's not. Come. It's a glass. Come with me. Look. Look. We're not gonna fall, girl. There's a glass. You're not gonna fall. Oh. Come. Wow. It's a glass. You did it. Yeah. About to go down the slide, you ready? Yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> So we just got back from our play date at what was this place called happy kingdom so that was my first time going there it's like in the west end of town mm -hmm. so if you're from toronto and you're looking for somewhere and great for your kids to go to to have a great time and you don't feel like you're spending too much money and you just want somewhere different to go to happy kingdom is a great place they also have like um and then nobody didn't Share with the toys, and then somebody can go downstairs. Okay. Mommy. And then, Mommy. I, no, I need a turn. No, I need a turn. I said I need a turn. No. Stop. No. I said no. stop. Give me a turn. No. Give me a turn. No. Give me a turn to talk. No. Harmony, yeah, Melody, thank you. I'm speaking now. So if you're looking for somewhere inexpensive, something different than Flying Squirrel and Sky Zone, to take your kids to, go find yourself at Happy Kingdom. They have a lot of food there. They also have like um, Chinese cuisine there. Um, I believe it's Chinese, but they have Asian cuisine there and it was very, very, very good. Um, and they also had pizza. Unfortunately, my kids can't eat any of the foods that they provided there um, as a result of their allergies. So we found ourselves a local McDonald's not too far. It was maybe like five minutes up the street and that's where they ate. Um, but how was you guys day today? Did you have fun? Yeah. Yeah, what was your favorite part about today? Playing with my new friend and Kennedy. That's awesome. What was your favorite part, Nini? Playing with my cat and crawling, playing with her. That's so sweet. And my favorite part was obviously catching up with the girlies and just getting some time to spend with the, the littles as well. And you know, just having a good day because I got to spend the time with, I'm again repeating myself now, spending time with the girlies. When I said that I was talking about the older, the mothers, not the little people, the mothers that I was able to connect with. Um, so that was nice. Also, I never pointed it out, but you guys already know that I am so big on the matchy matchy 2020 type thing. So of course me and the girls were all matching in our shirts today. Let's see our shirts. Everybody look at our shirts. Hey, Melanie, move your hand. Let's see your top. Hey, she's not too excited about it, but I am obviously. And it says all love. All love because that's all we got all day, every day. All love for each of the. Um, and the back says. It actually says the same thing. It says all love 1979. Not sure what the reference is with the 1979 bit, but it is what it is. For all the mothers out there who have two daughters or multiple daughters do they fight like this do they argue and bicker um, like this how long does it last because harmony was doing that not me yeah. it's all about harmony it's all about her so you had no parts in it no okay well mommy i'm tired me too so it is hair day so we are about to wash melody's hair or wash hair day i don't know what i choose to call it i call it whatever i feel like calling Mommy. it in the moment but yeah. i am currently taking out her <laughs> hairstyle and then i'm gonna give her a Mommy, wash no, and you, give her a new style you yes. know what it could call what? hair wash <laughs> okay so melody melody's choosing for us to call the day hair wash so 
I'll take you guys on the hair journey. Having girls is tough, y'all, because you always have to be washing and combing hair and all that stuff. But it comes with the territory. Wouldn't trade these girls for the world. This is our little washing station. So we got a shampoo buddy. It was actually gifted to us from the company um, shampoo buddy so get into it if you don't already have one but it's good because they have the comfort cushion for her neck up comfort cushion right here please and then it has like a little base right here this little tray right here so you can see shampoo buddy right here shampoo buddy get into them because the product is great so I used to use this tray part here for um, catching her hair in it so it didn't go in the sink so like it didn't touch the sink portion but now I use it to pack the towel in and then give her like a little brace for her neck so the support is much better so we're about to get into wash day I'm still trying to figure out what products to use in their hair so I've been using this Shea Moisture Baby one for a really long time and then I introduced um, the Argan Oil Company from Cream of Nature I've been using this for many years um, but yeah, I really haven't found a great combination for them, but this is so far what I'm using. And then I have some more products that I use over there in their hair. But Melody's really upset because Harmony broke her headband. Melody is such a girly girl. She loves wearing these things. So I'm either going to have to hot glue it back together or maybe just take this part off and then glue it onto a new headband because we do like this print. It goes with a lot of her school stuff. Oh wait, whoa, I want to oh. put glue on it. Okay, all right, we're we gonna fix it, girl. After you done my hair, could we put glue on it, please? Okay, sure. Let's get into this hair wash day. Okay. So this is her hair right me trying to vlog and wash at the same time i got the floor all wet so i'm gonna go get the mop clean up and then come back so this is her hair all shampooed up right here looking nice and thick and luscious and beautiful because she hair, got that black girl magic my, hair my, my hair is so always, there we go this is her hair my hair is always beautiful. That's good. It and, is always beautiful. And never change. It's never change. Even I like how God created my hair. Say that again for me, girl. I like God, how he created my hair. Oh, yes, because your black is beautiful. Yeah. Get it, honey. <gasps> that just warmed my heart. Anyways, I'm gonna finish this hair washing routine. I'm not really good at drying and wetting my hands and wetting it and drying it again just to vlog this part. So that's the portion of the hair that y'all are gonna get and then I'll get the other parts to you. It's safe to say that Melody loves her hair. Melo, come here, let me see. Show the people your hair. So last week, you guys saw it. She had one on this side, one on this side. So she said this week she wants a one ponytail. So turn around, let's see the finished produit. That means product. There we go, we got the beads on the back. Turn, let's see the other side. Boom, give us a pose. Boom, hey, give me another pose. Ooh, and one more for the last show. Boom. Get it, girl. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. How do you feel about your hair? <laughs> Very excited and happy. So today the girls are at school and daycare, and I have a day off, so I'm chilling out with Dee today. So he just went ahead. Actually, this morning we went to the gym. I, I kept my word. I said, I'm starting the gym on Monday. I just got to follow through the rest of the week and get there. I think I can do it. I just got to follow through. We'll see. This is week one. All right. So anyways, we went to the gym. We worked out on two different things, but we did our thing. And then went home, had a bite to eat, and he just grabbed a wild blueberry muffin. And remember the other day when Dee was trying on his um, Fashion Nova fits for you guys and they were like super massive? Well, he found himself a dry cleaners and they do alterations and repairs and all that stuff too. So he dropped off one or two? One. He dropped off one shirt 
so he's gonna test to see if they do a good job and if they do a good job then he'll drop off the rest to them so let's hang in here for the big reveal and see how they altered it i don't even know which shirt he dropped off but i'm excited to see how it fits hmm. and i think they'll do a good job i, I think i trust them i used to use these guys like 10 years ago so she's, she's still yes here. for your pants same lady yeah, same lady so. yeah so i right. should get the job done so it turned out you guys remember it looks what it, good you guys remember what it looked like when i first tried it on it was terrible but it came here she fixed it up so if you are in scarborough and you need a dry cleaner i'll tell you where to go all right <laughs> this past weekend actually at the wedding i wore heels for the first time in like years okay that's a lie i do wear heels every now and then but i wore like thin heels i usually wear like walk heels now because they're more comfortable but I wear like thin heels with like open toes or whatever and my calf is literally killing me as a result. It's as though I did a workout, which I guess I did do a workout because I had to practice bouncing and staying up or whatever, but man, I'm like kind of limping and it's kind of uncomfortable. I hate being sore of any kind. And we are done. That took what felt like forever, but I don't think it was actually that long. But. The beauty about having my mom pick up Melody off the school bus is that even if we run over time, we have that extra help. So school is done for Melody right now. Um, so we're blessed to have that, that help, that service for us. Yes, that was our car, but we ain't trying to steal it. We just, I don't know what happened. Groceries. A couple weeks ago, or maybe it was like last week, Dean did a video um i think he posted it on youtube but he also posted it on instagram and he was like shaking his hand and and basically saying like he told wifey that dinner was on him but he was about to pay and he wasn't un he wasn't sure what was going to come off on that card that's literally what it's like that was a very long explanation but that's literally what it's like grocery shopping in this country like it costs an arm and a leg like what we have back here is more than $300 literally when I saw the numbers just going up I was like what can I take off of this list what can I take off but I think the hard part for us is that our kids have to eat everything that is like um, gluten free dairy free all of the freeze so those foods are expensive for example a pack of what is it three cookies that come with five pieces in each cost eight dollars and 79 cents that lasts only three days of school so literally we can't even avoid spending less than that and it also sorry and it sucks but we got to do what we got to do 